Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. I know it's been a like a day or so, a couple days since I've uploaded. Um, but today we are going to be covering how to install a custom loading screen and I'm going to show you how to customize the one. Like change, really all you're doing is changing the text in this one. Um, but how to customize it for your server. So. pop over here jump over to our FX server now this is one I've kind of customized for a roleplay server that I am working on um, I removed the second line of text but it's this nice little guy right here so once we get in and we can actually leave the game I'll show you how to do it now I removed the music from mine. There is no music in mine. Uh, it does come with music, but I have mine disabled because I don't like music in in loading screens all that much. Don't know why we fall over every time we log in, but it is what it is. Disconnect me from GTA Online. So I will leave a download link in the description, but we are using this one by Trolling Seagull. This is the one that we have, this is the one we download. By the time the uh, next couple of videos I'm going to work on probably developing a custom one, you can show that and I'll release that for you guys to download. So we just simply drag and drop it into resources, I change mine to, lo to say loading screen, and you want to focus on, I deleted the readme and license file. But all you need to do is worry about the index.html. Now I use a program called uh, Brackets. You can open it just the same. Oh, excuse me, in Notepad++. This is just what I use for HTML uh, development stuff. So. We s we're in our index, here we go. It has two lines. This will have stuff. Whoops. This will have stuff here. And you guys can add something on the second line if you want. You don't have to. I just left mine disabled like that. But Pennsylvania State Roleplay. That's what this one says. That's the one we use. So, you just go in and customize it like that. It's kind of going to be a short video. But for me, I just put. If I can. I just put Pennsylvania. I'm not going to type that out again. It's a stupid word to spell. <clears throat> and then we just have state RP outside of the strong, and that's how we got that loading screen there. You activate it the same way, I just drag and drop it into my resource folder, right in here with all the other stuff, and then you just do start loading screen. We're just going to call this hashtag resources. So anything that's not like a vehicle or anything like that, I, I recommend doing this. I know I didn't do it in the last video, but this is how I'd recommend having everything set up. So guys. I know this was kind of a short video, but customizing a loading screen isn't really that hard. Uh, it just depends on the one that you download. I will leave a link down below in the description for the one we are using. But guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed, and I hope to see you all back here again tomorrow for another video. Goodbye.